<clears throat> hey guys, it's me. Um, I'm going to do a diaper bag video about what's in my Christmas Eve diaper bag video for taking the, my three boys to be baby Jesus. They're all going to be baby Jesus at one point. Um, so yeah, I can't believe tomorrow's Christmas Eve. Like, I'm not super excited like I used to be. But, um, definitely, you know, am getting there. So Max is over here. He's kind of relaxing. Um, in this back, let me put you down here. There we go. There we go. In this back pocket here, I have just a wipes case. Um, my custom one is somewhere, but it just always, you know, that's a cute one. But I kind of also like the plain one because it looks more real. Um, so that's there. Um, I have a plastic bag in there. I don't know why. I don't need it in there, but it just is on that side. I need to put a. I need to put a bottle. Um. I'm finding trash in the other pocket. I need to put a bottle in there. But on the other side, I have this Lunchables water. But it's this cute little bottle, and I thought it'd be perfect just to have to pretend like to make formula with or something. Um, so that's on the other side. I have hanging here um, my pacifier holder, and I have in it this pacifier and this um, animal face one which I love and I and they stick but I've been sticking them like that because if you're not careful and you stick them on this end here it'll um, rub off the design so yeah it says it holds two pacifiers but I can get like three in there three neck ones so um, I'm going to show you the inside um, just give me a second So yeah, on the inside, let's see. Uh, you've seen whatever bag before, but this mesh pocket, there's two mesh pockets. I have Desitin, which I'm not going to use on a cloth baby. Now if I had the Grace doll or something, I'd slather it all over. And some, some Johnson's um, cotton swabs. That were like 97 cents a pack or something. In the other mesh pocket, I have a um, Winnie the Pooh. I've had this forever. I have two of them actually. Winnie the Pooh pacifier holder thing. I have another one that has a green uh, strap on it. But I think the red matches a lot better with Winnie the Pooh. Somebody, my dad must be. Maybe they're wrapping presents. I don't know. But in this back pocket here, I have um, one diaper that came with Max. I need to change this soon. And I have some preemie ones that are Benji's. Um, his, I think, needs to be changed soon, too. But um, I definitely need to go out and get some more. Um, I just spent all my money for this week, last week. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, um bought stuff online um oh yeah i should show you yeah um i think i have all the pieces but i'll show you in a second what max got for christmas but yeah this is the one that connor sent me and um, I forget, let me see what size it is it says it's a size one and i think the size one um fit him a little better because newborns fit they're a little tight it kind of squeezes his his body, but I have that in there. So I'm, I'm gonna shop around and see if I can find the cheapest brand of diapers I can find, just so I can get a bigger pack for cheaper. But okay. So inside, let's see what I have inside here. I have his um, monkey bear hat. Um. 
these gray pants, which you've seen, which I love on him, which fit him really good. Um, I, I don't know if you remember I got some formula in the mail, so I just put some in this little container. Um, I'd actually, you can see it in there, I actually like to get one of those like Parents' Choice uh, formula holder things that you fill it up and I think that'd be cool. So I have that. I have his toy um, that vibrates, that hangs off his car seat. Um, his shoes for Christmas Eve. Oh man, I dropped one. I'll get it. Um, let's see, what else do I have? Um, I have his jeans, which you've all seen, which for some reason, like, I bought them and they just look like jeans to me, you know, just cheapy jeans, but then you look at them, like, like, sometimes I look at them and I go, you know, they look like fancy designer, you know, they're not just one denim color, they've got, you know, like, you can kind of see that they've got, like, a gradient of color in them, and that's so they look a lot cuter. Um, his sweater vest, which I'm not going to unfold because it's nicely folded. Um, this, the shirt that goes underneath it. Um, I thought his Santa hat was in here. Um, his Christmas jammies, which I think you've all seen. And I think in this front pocket I have some crackers that have been in here, some pepper jack <laughs> that I've eaten a few of. But just to kind of, if I'm ever in a position where, okay, I'm a little hungry, you know, I need something, I don't like collapse. So, yeah, let's, um, yeah, these pants are just in case if, like, I don't get a chance to, like, almost likely probably put it, put Max in his jammies when we're done, um, but, yeah, but, um, yeah, this is a solid toy, dropped the other shoe, I'm gonna be putting in tomorrow, at some point, his blanket blanket, which is turning into his, like, hold on and suck my thumb blanket, with, um, his little toy, and almost likely, just to have another blanket. I'll put his socks in there too. Um, would be this blanket. Um, that's pretty much it. I'll probably add some more stuff. But. Let me see if I can find all the pieces. Yes, I do have all the pieces. So this is Max's Christmas present. Um, it came with this short sleeve shirt. I bought it off a lady on Facebook. Um, it has blue. These shorts, which do look kind of weird because of the bottom part. But, and this adorable shirt that says, Give me hugs. And it's blue. Um, this came in the mail the day and my dad was like, Oh, I hope that we don't have to share Christmas with an inanimate object because I said something about wrapping it and I'm like, oh my gosh, you know, it's like annoying. It's like, I hope I don't have to share Christmas with an inanimate object, but like whatever. You know, I had planned to do a video, like I get up at like 5 o'clock anyways, so I had planned to do at some point a video of Max opening his presents, <clears throat> you know, before you guys even get up. You know, before they even get up, that's when my plan was, because he's got another present under the tree. So, yeah, I just need to wrap this. I'll just, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna seriously wrap it, wrap it. I'm gonna like it nicely. I'm not, I mean, I'm gonna make it okay, but I'm not gonna like, you know, 
wrap it really good because it's just going to be open and, you know, it's like, who really cares? So, yeah. I have a few minutes. Um, I'm doing a swap, and I know this is kind of bad, but, um, I was way over the $15 limit. Well, I'm pretty sure I was, and since I'm going to have a girl within the next year or two, I'm pulling some of this stuff out and saving it. A lot of the, there's a lot of stuff in there. There's like a blanket and a gown and like bibs and some mittens and stuff. But the girl that I was going to do the swap with, me and this girl, so here's the story. Me and this girl had originally started out with uh, like two or three months ago, had decided, you know, oh, let's do a swap. You know, and it can be a Christmas swap, and fifteen dollars is going to be our limit. Well, apparently, just re recently, she scammed two girls into um, having them both pay for the same doll and stuff, which you know was bad. But um, so she got banned. So I'm sending to another girl. I'm not going to say who it is. Uh, I'm going to message her and get this stuff off after the holidays just because it's way too busy, um, but I'll let her know that, and, um, so I took some of the stuff out just because it's cute, and one of the stuff was brand new when I paid for it, and with my money, and I kind of like to keep it because it's really cute, and it'll look really cute on Maxine, but here's some of the stuff I pulled out, um, this Paul Frank hat, which I think is adorable, um, yeah, there's, there are, there is some stuff in there. So it's not like she's getting a bunch of crappy, crappy stuff. You know, I just don't have money to go out and buy brand new stuff. Um, this cute little Winnie the Pooh dress that I had to try on Max, and he looked adorable. But he was all boy to me, so he definitely looked like a cross-dresser. So, um, this bib, which I think is so cute. It says Little Ladybug and has the, the, um has a ladybug in the corner kind of like sticking out um this uh, newborn onesie which I bought at Walmart the gray animals and I don't know I think it's oh this is actually preemie I don't think this is going to fix Mac, fit Maxine but I got it on sale or something so what else did I pull out there was another bib. Oh yeah, this adorable um, double-sided um, giraffe bib with this pattern on the other side. And I think that giraffe is going to be Maxine's thing. Like, probably just animals in general. They're both, you know, like both animals in general are their thing. So, I just think that's so cute. Because I got it in a thing at their store and like, uh, so yeah, I'm like, I have this too, I don't know if you've seen this before, I got that on sale for like a dollar something, it went with an outfit, but I think it like fell off, and it doesn't really go with anything he has, but it was just too cute to pass up, so, um, that's pretty much it, um, I just need to add a bottle in there, just to make it look real, I don't know if I'll feed him at all but yeah so comment rate subscribe and suggest bye guys